And today the Elmwood Village is welcoming back a beloved piece of the community. The Crane Branch Library is holding its grand reopening celebration later this morning after more than a year of undergoing renovation. Yeah, and this morning we are lucky enough to be joined by John Spears in studio this morning the director of the Buffalo and Erie County Public Library. Yeah, morning, welcome. Thanks for being here this morning with us. Tell us a little bit more about the renovation. How extensive was it and what will people see when they go to this branch on Elmwood? So the renovation was pretty huge. It actually happened in two phases. Uh, the most recent phase took over a year starting last August. And the first thing people are going to notice when they walk in is an elevator. For so many years, people could not get to the second floor of the library in, in, without it being ADA accessible, and now it finally is. We've added meeting rooms to the first floor, meeting rooms to the second floor, replaced all of the flooring. Really, it is a completely different library than what it was that people re will remember. Yeah, and it's such a big part of that neighborhood. As we were talking, I got my first library card there. That's when stone tablets and Sanskrit were the only thing you could get. But it is such a huge part. How are you tying in the renovations and bringing the Elmwood Village and Allentown and the whole surrounding community in? Yeah, so we're having a um, celebration today at 1015 and everyone's invited to come down and, and see the library. It really is something pr pretty spectacular. Um, we e everything has been redone down to the, the plantings on the inside of the library. Oh, that's great. And, you know, as for this library, I think a lot of people watching might say, well, I don't live near the Elmwood Village, so I'm, you know, I don't know if I'm going to get there. It's a, it's a good destination, though, to see this brand new library. But for folks who have the neighborhoods in their own library, their libraries in their own neighborhoods, what kind of things other than books can you get oh, at yeah. a library nowadays? You know, we have 37 locations across all of Erie County, and we are a lot more than books. You can check out sporting equipment. You can um, check out um, things digitally, so you don't even have to come into the library. If you want a book on uh, an audio book or a movie or, or some music, you can come into the libraries or you can just do it, do it from home through one of your devices. Mm -hmm. We've expanded beyond just books. Um, we have a library of things now. In some of our libraries, you can check out musical, uh, musical instruments, you can check out electronic equipment check out fishing poles. Um, your best thing to do is just call your local library or go to our website at www.buffalolib.org and you can see what each of the locations has to offer. There you go, because Melissa's been looking for a viola. There you go. <laughs> there you go. All right, and once again, real quickly, uh, what's happening today as far as the celebration in the community? So it's really just meant to be a, a kind of a thank you to the community and welcoming them back into Crane. It's been out of commission for quite a while and I live in that community, so I was very aware that people wanted that library open again. And this is a way of thanking the community for their patience, welcoming them back into the library. There'll be some food, there'll be music, of course there'll be a lot of speeches, but you know, please come out and, and see what it is that has been taking all this time to make this the best experience that we could. Glad to have a piece sure. of the Elmwood Village back where it belongs. Yep. So John Spears, director of the Buffalo and Erie County Public Libraries, thanks so much for being here this morning with Thank us you. here on Daybreak. All right.